Voters across the Commonwealth also chose their Democratic candidate for lieutenant governor at the polls today. 10 News reporter Annie Schroeder picks up our team coverage live in the news newsroom tonight with the latest results on the race. Annie. Yeah, John and Brittany, Delegate Tala Ayala ultimately won the Democratic candidate nominee to potentially replace current Lieutenant Governor Justin Fairfax. Now, Ayala was called by the Associated Press as she currently has nearly 38% of the vote, with a majority of the precincts reporting. Ayala was a cybersecurity specialist before she was elected to serve in her current role in the House of Delegates in 2017. She currently represents a portion of Northern Virginia. Tonight, she thanked her supporters vir virtually and said she will work to represent all Virginians if elected this November. We need to rebuild our local economy stronger than before, creating jobs to support our small businesses and workers. We need to expand access to health care and lower prescription drugs. We need to invest in our infrastructure like broadband and bridge the digital divide facing our rural communities. Local delegate Sam Rasool also ran for the seat but came in second place. He will continue in his current role with the House of Delegates. Now, Ayala is going against Republican candidate Winsome Sears for the seat. Whoever wins the seat in November will ultimately be the first female of the Virginia State Senate. Live in the newsroom tonight, Annie Schroeder, 10 News, working for you.